if you pause it. I was thinking of ordering something on Deliveroo so we can eat while we watch the videos. So what are you gonna order? Maybe a pie of pizza? And what topping? I don't know, mushroom, salami, but that's not kosher. True. But what is the reason for kosher? Truth is, I don't know. Why don't we Google it? So let's do that then. Hey guys, I think I got the answer for you. Before I explain the answer, we first have to understand that there's three types of mitzvahs in the Torah. Number one, Chokim, Mishpatim, and Eidos. Mishpatim are mitzvahs that we don't need the reason for them because they're so obvious. For example, don't steal, don't kill. Then we have Chokim. Chokim are mitzvahs that we don't have a reason for them. We do it simply because God told us to do so. And the mitzvah of not eating milk can be together falls into the category of a chok because we don't have a reason for it. We simply do it because God told us. Rabbi, you just said that the mitzvah of not eating milk can be together is a chok. Why then? It's a sitting in parshas we spot it. The rabbi explained that the Torah is trying to teach us a phenomenal lesson. But before I tell you that lesson, let me tell you an example. If someone asks you to take a box to your bedroom, you may or may not be excited. But when they tell you that's the new model drone in it, you'll be running up the stairs. The same is with the Chukim Amishpah. The Torah is trying to teach us that although we may not be so excited about doing Chukim, we don't even have a reason for them. But no, we can still have the same enthusiasm as we would if we were doing a Mishpah. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Have a good Shabbos, and see you next time.